The PWR Air Pack training system comes with removable backpack straps, rapid inloading feature, and three insert tubes. Please check out our products at pwrtraining.com. Each exercise is designed specifically to help you beat the CPAT test. For a full version of this workout, go to PWR Training YouTube channel. I'm Brandon Wingard, I'm in the Fire Academy, and I'm training for the CPAT test. Brandon's PWR sandbag is loaded with 50 pounds and he keeps it on during the entire workout. The first exercise is a box step up. Step up once, squat once. Step up twice, squat twice. Repeat this, increasing in numbers for the full three minutes. Take as much time as you need between each exercise and start back as soon as you can. The next exercise is called knee to standing. Lower yourself gently to your knees and stand back up. Repeat this for 45 seconds. Immediately without taking a break, go into the dumbbell row. Try to use 25 pounds for each dumbbell. This is simulating the hose drag. Do this for the remaining 45 seconds. Next exercise is the equipment carry. Brandon's going to pick up 45 pounds in each hand and walk 150 feet. Brandon's PWR sandbag is loaded down with about 55 pounds and he keeps it on during the entire workout. Once again, take as much of a break as you need to between each exercise. On the dumbbell presses, I like to face my palms towards my face at the bottom and turn them away from me at the top. It seems safer and more ergonomically correct. Sitting up and grabbing something right around 10 to 20 pounds, twist from side to side and try to touch it on both sides of your body. This is simulating a sledgehammer. This next movement is two parts. It's 15 seconds of hand release push-ups, followed by 15 seconds of what I call spiders. Do as many rounds as you can in 90 seconds. This is simulating the maze crawl. When you're doing these spiders, think about bringing your knee as high up onto your arm as you can. Because what you're really trying to do is strengthen your core and your hip flexors. During the mannequin drag, you're going to use a lot of your quads and your glutes. So this is a reverse lunge with a squat. Squat and then reverse lunge, alternating legs. The last exercise is a kettlebell swing. Drop the weight between your knees, push forward with your hips, and try to come at least above your head with the weight. 90 seconds. And that's the workout. All right, Brandon, you ready for the CPAP? Not yet, but I will have to use my PWR train sandbag. Good luck, buddy. Congratulations on your future as a firefighter.